Hey everyone, Robert here coming at you with a real quick Sony Vegas tip and in this tip we're going to be taking a look at drawing envelope points using the envelope brush. So let's start off by adding an envelope to this audio track right here. I'm going to right click on the audio track header. I'm going to go to insert remove envelope and choose volume. So here's the volume envelope and if you've experienced envelopes before this looks familiar to you and you should know what the envelopes look like. Now to adjust the envelope you can double click in certain spots to add key points and adjust the volume there just like this or you can highlight a certain area and adjust the volume like that. But what if there was an easier way to draw on this and make adjustments that way? Well there is. All you have to do is hold down shift when you're hovering over the envelope here and watch the cursor turn into the envelope brush. So I'm holding down shift now and I let go of shift, hold down shift and we can actually click and draw on this. Now when I draw on this, I can go up and then I can go back down. I can make all kinds of adjustments, but when I let go, the keyframes are going to smooth out into as little keyframes as possible. Now if you actually do want all those keyframes to be exactly how you drew them, you can actually go to Options, preferences and in the external control and automation tab here we can uncheck smooth and thin automation data after recording or drawing so when we uncheck that click apply and OK and we draw all those keyframes are going to be recorded so this really depends on your preference you know if you want everything to be exactly how it is and you want to have that many keyframes that'll be the way to go or you can just leave it at the default and have it smooth out the keyframes. So there you have it, drawing envelope points in Sony Vegas using the envelope brush. Just one other way to help speed up your workflow. Thanks a lot for watching. If you like this video, be sure to click the little like button down below. And if you'd like to see more like these, click the subscribe button up at the top. You can also visit the first link in the description below to visit this post on robertsproductions.net. All my follow links are in the description below as well. Again, I hope this helped. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.